They definitely gave us someone else's room. Amazing. More than happy to have a delayed flight. Oh, okay. <laughs> Today it is 4.10 a.m. Uh, I stayed in the hotel at PDX last night if you are keeping track of uh, the last vlog. And uh, we are, we gotta go to the airport and we fly out of Portland uh, to New York in hour and a half, hour 45, so we should be good there. Um, but today's video is gonna be going from Portland to New York. All right, everything is packed up. We're leaving the hotel. If you've been to the travel vlogs before, you'll probably recognize this place. Stay here every time. <laughs> Basically, we got all of our bags. We got to go to parking at the airport, check bags, get to the gate, and go. Uh, we are flying Delta first class, which is great. My personal favorite. So looking forward to that. All right, made it to parking. Just for uh, just to remember, we are in I six or I one because I will forget, I'm getting footage of me saying that, so I'll remember. Help him remember. I, I six or I one. Maddie remember this, please. <laughs> I six or I one. All right, made it through security. Um, boy, oh boy, I love TSA pre-check. Uh, I'm still waiting for him. It's been about 15, 20 minutes. His line is probably 400, 500 people. My line is like, with like six people. Incredible, so uh, I'm just waiting for him to get through uh, security, then we're off to the gate and we're in the air. Going really well. <laughs> All right, so um, there's good screens here and for first class to watch movies and stuff. And normally, normally they give you these, right? And these aren't like, they're okay. So I thought ahead and brought these, the Apple ones, and I just took them out of my bag. <laughs> it's just an empty <laughs> Apparently I already opened these at home. So uh thank you, Delta. Alright, so we got to Salt Lake and found out that our flight is uh, about three hours delayed. So we're gonna be here for about five hours. So when we got here, I was like, man, I wonder if there's like a spa massage place because we have so much time, uh, so much time to waste. Oh yeah, let's go. Hey guys, it's us. I'm here in the Salt Lake City Airport, still on our flight delay. Now let's go check on our boy Maddie, see how he's doing. How are you feeling there? Oh, great, much needed. I, I don't know why, uh, I think I've been sleeping weird lately. You or mentioned something, that, yeah. More than happy to have a delayed flight. Shout out to Bo, who's working his magic this <laughs> morning. <sighs> It's perfect. Thank you to Express Spa. Absolutely meeting our needs at this time. Oh my goodness. So, how'd it go? Oh, great. You've been up in the air for a long time now. This has <laughs> also, to be Also, can restored. you see how they do the chair here and not how I did it in my house? Do you notice that I bought one of those chairs and put it together completely wrong? In fact, I think the seat part's backward. All right, well, that was, uh, I feel great. Really needed that with all this traveling. How, how was that for you? Necessary. Yeah. Very, very necessary. First first uh, airport <coughs> massage ever? Yeah, never done it before. So Glad we did. I got another first we could do. First, you ever been to a Sky Lounge? Never. Well, it, let's go. It's time. All right, we're in the Sky Lounge. We're gonna go up here, uh, probably grab some food and just chill. Shout out to Delta, love the Sky Lounge. It is the best amenity of having the credit card I have. So let's go. All right, so we just had uh, what? Br uh, brunch? Brunch. Lunch. Um, it is 11.09 p.m. Flight is delayed uh, for, we, we got about two and a half more hours till we go board. Yeah, we're just, we're just hanging out in the lounge. We didn't even have breakfast, we had orange juice, and it was thoroughly satisfying, but that was all it was. That's a good point. We're just gonna enjoy the lounge, relax a little bit, and then 
we have about two and a half hours till, till the flight, so. Thoughts on the Delta Sky Lounge, first time? It's very pleasant here. Yeah. Super airy, yeah. pilots everywhere, food is great. Yeah. Very nice layover spot. This one is especially nice. Hopefully we'll go back out to the side again, but you get mountain views out here in Salt yeah. Lake City, and uh, the views from the airport are actually really quite nice. So. Really good cookies. Um, all right, it is now, uh, we're looking at 12, 26 p.m. We've slept about six hours and three and a half days. So I'm definitely gonna try to get some sleep on this plane. Looking at our seats on the app, I think this plane, this first class, is not the pods, but it's like a step up from the one you just saw. Um, I think it's, we're like in the middle, and I think these may recline, we'll see. I'm not sure. We'll go over to the gate here in a minute, and then uh, we'll get going off to New York. All right, we're at the gate, still delayed a little bit, so we were supposed to take off at, a, at 11 a.m. Uh, it is now, now 1.35 p.m., and the plane just landed that we're getting on from Atlanta, so they have to clean it, sanitize it, all that good stuff. So I think it's gonna be at least another 20 or so before we can get on, but from there, then it's about a four, four and a half hour flight to New York, and we should be there, uh, yeah, we were supposed to be there about five o'clock, and it's gonna be about nine o'clock now. And if we're being honest, so. smooth sailing. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna be an That's easy flight. Hopefully, hopefully, yeah. Uh, okay, I have his too. Did that go? Yep. Perfect. All set. Thank you. Thank you guys. Here we go. That was a long flight. Waiting for right there. Waiting for bags to come out, and then we actually hired car server, so we should have a chauffeur, which is really nice. Uh, he'll help with bags and all of that, so I'll try to get that. But it's a long day. But uh, we here. We're here. We made it. Oh my goodness, they made it. Apologize, we got no delayed problem. majorly yeah. out of Salt Lake City. I got your message from you. Oh, got our bags, everything's good. And chauffeur is right there, he's going to get the car. I think it's an Escalade, which is nice, a lot of room, very comfy. If you can afford it, I know it's not something that you need to do, but if you can afford getting car service, I highly recommend it. It's just so much better. Everything's planned, you're not waiting for an Uber. They're very helpful, um, they know where they're going. Highly recommend. So. We are here. It's kind of like weirdly hot here. It is humid. Humid. We're in the swamp for real. Humid, but it's like kind of raining. I don't know. To the hotel we go. I will tell you more about this hotel that we're staying at when we get there. It's very exciting. And there it is. The car service in the Escalade. Only the best. Let's go. Amazing. All right, you're not gonna believe it, but we got we got the room. I have a funny story about it, but we got the room. I'm gonna give you a quick room tour. Um, so really quickly, let me get in here for some better light. Okay, so really quickly, something really interesting about the hotel we're at is it just opened. It's on 48th in uh, in New York, so right by Times Square. And this is the brand new, uh, opened like four weeks ago, the brand new Hard Rock Cafe. So everything is brand new, shiny. It's beautiful. Room tour incoming. Let's go. Right when you walk in, we got a little espresso maker, coffee stuff. Uh, this is kind of cool. Call the front desk to check out your complimentary yoga kit for during your stay. You want to do some couples yoga? Uh, so we got some water. I like. I just hope you guys see like. By the way, that, that there's me. Um, like this is nice. Okay, so here we go. So there's that. Two queens. We got the game on. Uh, going for Golden State in this one. Um, there's that, and then there's a little table here. 
How you feeling? We made it. We made it. I'm going to pass out so hard in about <laughs> half an hour, but this is <laughs> this is wonderful so far. The hotel accommodations are fantastic. Okay, so here is the funny story. So I booked this hotel weeks ago, right? We show up. Um, I hand him my ID. I'm like, hey, we're checking in. And he says, we don't have any rooms with two beds. Now look, I have known Huss for upwards of 27 years or more. Am I against sleeping in the same bed as him? No. That being said, he's also a sicko, and I would love to have at least a foot and a half between us in separate structures of bedding. Um, he was like, we don't have a room with two beds. So I was like, well, isn't that what we booked? Like, what's what's going on here? He went he went in the back room, he, he came out, and he goes, okay, a room cleared up, you're good. I get to the room, and this is sitting on the table, addressed to Nadine Dressler. Inside is a note, a custom personalized handwritten note that says, Dear Miss Dressler, welcome to New York and our newest Hard Rock Hotel. It's a pleasure to have you stay with us. They for sure gave us someone else's room. <laughs> Specifically, Miss Dressler. So, uh, Miss Dressler, if you somehow come across this, maybe you're searching Hard Rock you know, New York, and you come somehow come see this. Couple things. One, sorry for taking your room. We needed it though, but like, I hope you found something. Secondly, um, they gave you four pieces of chocolate, and there's only one left um, in the thing, but still a nice touch. And I was done with that, so sorry, Mr. Dressler, but I hope that you found. Don't love this one. <laughs> what is it? What's the flavor? It's not bad. It's definitely, it's a raspberry. And it just threw me off. I was thinking caramel, mm. coconut, something, and then it was like fruity. Mm. Threw me off. Anyway, just kind of funny story. Although now I'm wondering where's, what room is our note in that they gave to someone else. Okay, so here's the plan. It is 10, it is 11.30. We went to bed last night at midnight. We got up at 3.30 a.m. We had a five hour delay another hour delay on the plane. Um, it has been a long day. So here's the plan, and this is the end of the video. Downstairs, there's a really famous uh, pizza place called Ray's Pizza. Um, we're gonna go there and buy so many slices of pizza. We're gonna bring it back up here. We're gonna eat pizza. I'm gonna shower real quick, and I am going to be in this bed, not awake. Um, comment below if you want this side or this side kidding let's 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 not solicit that so coolest thing I'm gonna show you the coolest thing about this room we got the Gaga room uh, if you know me I love Gaga Lady Gaga of course and so check this out oh I haven't even shown you the bathroom this is the bathroom look at this so there's me there's a cool like bluish look at that walk-in shower uh, 24 karat gold fixtures you gotta love it good lighting in here I don't know what this is this is probably I'm gonna guess a makeup mirror that you can turn on I hope I don't break it that's not a makeup mirror. oh it is a makeup mirror there's just no light on it whoa you're seeing me very close right now so look at this see this we got Gaga right there okay when you close the door look what happens to Gaga What? Shout out to Gaga. Gaga, if you see this, love you. Really cool. More than happy to stay in your new Hard Rock Cafe room. And to answer your question, it is really hard keeping it hardcore. <laughs> pizza should be here anytime. I think it's here. Let's see, New York. Legit New York pizza man looks like. Let's go. We got Oh, okay. All right, good night. <laughs> <laughs> uh.